Hey everybody, uh, it's Ian. It's December 30th, 2012, uh, which means that I'm now uh, two months and four days, or ten weeks and two days, on testosterone. Um, I'm coming to you from uh, my parents' house in Canada, where I am visiting for Christmas, um, and they are all at church right now, so I figured this would be a good opportunity to make a little update on my own. Um, a lot of things are happening still. Um, I guess I should just go ahead and start listing changes. Uh, so uh, voice uh, has definitely still uh, shifting. Um, I've noticed it crack cracking more uh, recently than um, I have in the past. Uh, so that's obviously awkward, but uh, you know, can only be a good sign for for things to come. Um, and I feel like overall it has just kind of gradually shifted uh, downwards, uh, and I can definitely speak at a lower range more comfortably. Um, I, th I think that's how I would characterize the, the change in my voice. Um, I can also uh, sing a little bit lower, which is super fun because I went and saw Les Mis uh, last week and um, it's uh, perfectly, very you know enjoyable to, to be able to sing a wider range of parts than I could <laughs> in the past. Um, so that is, has continued to shift. Um, uh, muscle growth I'm still noticing, uh, which is so striking given that like I haven't even really been working out seriously since I came home um, shortly before uh, Christmas. So it's, uh, it's just, I mean, it's like a little bit disheartening in a way to like think, well, I mean, what was the point of working out like before tea, you know, like I'm noticing so much more change still now, like than I ever did, you know, no matter how hard, how hard I worked out before. Um, but on the other hand, it's like, who cares? Like, it's like, it's really, really awesome. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. It's, it's pretty fun. Uh, to see. Um, so I can only imagine when I get to go uh, back uh, back to Oakland and uh, start actually working out um, what I'll be noticing. Um, that's fun. Um, I feel like um, uh, muscle redistribution, or sorry, fat redistribution uh, has really started um, kicking in. Um, you know, again, it takes a really long time to, to fully notice all the um, effects of the process, but I feel like I feel like the hips are definitely like they are they're different than than they were. I'm definitely noticing a, a lot of shifting around going on um, or beginning to go on. Um, so that's that's very, very fun and very, uh, yeah, just really gratifying. Um, what else is happening? Um, hair growth, I'm continuing to notice. Uh, basically, I would just say like wherever I kind of had darker hair, like it's just kind of expanding very, very gradually. I mean, it's really uh, it's still fairly, it's nothing that I could show you or anything, but it's definitely something that I am noticing. Um, also places where I had lighter hair before, um, I'm just, it's just coming in a, a little bit darker and longer. So, um, like arms for instance, um, uh, but also like thighs and stuff. And, um, I think, you know, just so like, you know, my, um, snail trail is just, you know, very, very gradually expanding and everything, but it's, I mean, it's, it's not super pronounced at this point. Um, I'm going to be honest. Um, I, I have, however, noticed actually that, um, I have like way more peach fuzz on my face, uh, than I did in the past. Um, uh, so it's, it's light, but it's actually longer, I think. I, I don't really understand how these things work. Um, but I feel like I have like slightly longer, um, you know, blondish hair, over most of my, um, you know, face and, and neck. So that's kind of cool. And I can only imagine now that we start getting darker hairs. Um, I, I did, I did notice some, um, upper lip, uh, darker hair, um, that I shaved before I came to my family. Cause I thought that would be a little unnerving for them. Um, uh, but I'm also noticing that I have like maybe six darker chin hairs as opposed to three. So that's cool. Um, so I, I, I guess we'll see uh, you know, that expanding on both fronts, both a lot of lighter hair and then a couple of darker hairs, uh, seems to be the pattern I'm noticing. Um, what else? I, uh, I have definitely noticed, I don't think I've noticed, noted this in my last video, but it was definitely, uh, in effect even then. I just need to sleep a lot. Like, I'm just really tired. Um, not, not, you know, not when I'm awake, like, I wouldn't say I'm just, like, constantly wanting to take a nap or whatever, but I, I just, I can't, stay up quite as late. I, I definitely can sleep in. And I think that's actually a very positive development. Um, before I started tea, I, I had trouble sleeping in. I really, I would get up, uh, way earlier than I needed to, um, on the weekends. And it was frankly kind of annoying. Like I, you know, I sort of felt like minor, minor insomnia kind of thing. Um, so honestly being able to sleep is pretty great. Um, uh, and I think, I think a positive development, um, it has meant that, um, 
that combined with my still kind of being on West Coast time has made this um, the the time zone adjustment very very difficult. I, I've been I just shamelessly been sleeping in uh, so much all break. So that has been really nice, very nice to be able to relax. Um, also, uh, I don't think I noted, maybe I did last month that my appetite has definitely increased. Um, I'm kind of grateful in that, um, what I really noticed around the first month was that I was so thirsty, like all the time. And, um, and that has not been quite as pronounced this month. Um, I mean, I still think probably drinking fluid is a good idea, but, uh, but it hasn't been quite as bad. Uh, so I'm uh, not going to complain with that. Um, has there been anything else? What can I think? Uh, emotionally, I still feel good. I mean, like I said, other than just the sleeping a lot, um, you know, more sex drive. So, but that's, like I said, that's fine. Um, and, and general growth. I mean, that's, that's definitely, uh, continued to happen. I mean, it's, it's one of the things that um, people say is often an earlier change. So that's nice to know I'm on schedule. Um, let's see what else is happening. Um, I don't know. My barber says that my hair is different, like the texture. Um, but I have no idea how I would, how, uh, I mean, I don't think I'd be as sensitive to that. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm feeling pretty good. Um, you know, it's, it's exciting to, to see a little bit of uh, change with the voice. Um, although like I noted last month, it's very, very psychological as well. Um, and you know, I think, I don't know, I'm mostly just really excited for, for things to come and, and happy with where I've been taken so far. I wonder if my face has changed. I don't know. It's one of those things that's really, really uh, subjective and very difficult to measure. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm doing really, 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 really well. And I hope you all are also. Um, and happy new year to you all. All right. Bye.